Well, each Friday, Gary Dick of Inside Indiana Business, he joins us with the big business stories of the week. And just in the last couple of seconds, yeah. you mentioned to me and informed me about a big announcement with Subaru. Yeah, absolutely. Subaru of Indiana Automotive in Lafayette, uh, Alyssa, huge news there. It continues uh, a big role for them. Uh, the company will invest $140 million into that plant, add 200 jobs for production of the uh, Ascent SUV, the brand new SUV just uh, unveiled in Lafayette and a couple of days ago at the LA uh, Auto Show as well. Uh, again, this plant on a roll, Alyssa, in the last four years alone, they have invested more than $1.3 billion and added 2,000 jobs uh, at that plant. They're now approaching 6,000 jobs there, so it's a huge success story. Jeez. Well, earlier this week, all of our attention was on this Fisher's company. Yep. What was that about? Yeah, Flexware Innovation is a technology company based in uh, Fisher's, announced late in the week, uh, an expansion. They're going to be uh, investing about $8 million, uh, adding about 70 jobs. Importantly, those jobs pay about 75% above the average. Yeah, Average wage in Hamilton County, uh, but also I had Mayor Scott Badness on the show this weekend and asked him about another big project coming up, and that is that forty million dollar uh, food and entertainment center that is about to roll. You're also today to be able to announce some of the restaurants they've signed their, their they've signed their leases are ready to go. Fisher's residents are going to be excited. I think we're a couple weeks away from the first announcement there, and then in January we hope to announce the culinary accelerator and the partner that's going to come alongside to really bring that to fruition, but uh, tons of progress behind the scenes. Uh, it will be a culinary epicenter on the northeast side of the metro area when it's all said and done. And Alyssa, uh, Mayor Fadness is announcing too, early in the week, he will announce uh, 2,200 job commitments over 2017, which is the best the Fishers has ever done. Jeez, it keeps getting yep. better and better. And then yep. what is going on with workers? What are they making at GE Aviation? And, well, it is, a, it is an amazing technology uh, a story at GE Aviation in Lafayette. Uh, the big aircraft engine uh, that they make there that go on the big uh, jet airliners. We'll have the story on Sunday, but it's really about what they're calling digital twins. So for each of these big aircraft engines that comes off the line, there is a digital and identical twin. And you talk about big data and how it all works for companies uh, around uh, the country. GE Aviation says these digital twins mm -hmm. make it easy to track uh, maintenance issues, actually predict when some of these engines might have problems or fail. So we'll, uh, we'll get into that on Sunday as well. Definitely looking forward to seeing yeah. more about that. Thank you, Gary. Mm -hmm. And you can learn much more about these stories on Inside Indiana Business. Remember, it's this Sunday right at 11 o'clock right here on Channel 13.